Well, hi, it's Jerry with I Love RV Life. Yay, the new camping season's here for the summer. You know, I like to talk about maintaining a healthy black tank, and we found a new product to try out that I think that you're going to find interesting. Yes, Jerry, I talk about this quite often, and that is how do you maintain a black tank? Let me take it a step further. How do you maintain a healthy black tank? What's a healthy black tank in Jerry's description? I like to see when the black tank is dumped that all the solids have been liquefied. There's a number of ways to be able to achieve this. I know there's so, so many products out there. I think we've tried every one of them at least once. What Joan and I don't like are what I call the green, the blues, the reds, the oranges. You know the ones. I'm not going to throw rocks at a product. If, if you like that perfumey smell that you put into your black tank to be able to treat your black tank, that's what you want to use. But for Joan and I, that's, that's just a, a terrible smell. When you get the odor of the black tank and then you try to hide it or mask it with some type of a perfumey smell, it's just, uh, it's just a terrible, terrible odor to me. I don't know which is worse, the perfume or the black tank odor, or both of them combined. It's just pretty terrible. And I've talked about this for several years. If you look at how to maintain your black tank, uh, if you look at several other discussions I've had about your black tank and types of toilet paper to use in your RV, all those videos that I have out there, I consistently discuss using an enzyme and using an enzyme product that's specifically designed for RV and marine use. Uh, the folks at Unique Camping and Marine provided us this product. I did not buy this. Uh, they contacted me and said, look, we've got a product called RV Digest It, and we'd like for you to give it a shot. I've not been compensated on this. The only thing they did was provide us a couple bottles of this and said, would you just try it? And if you like it, would you make a video? I'm going to do it because I've tried it and we liked it. So let me do this short before I go into this test. We've been on the road for about six weeks and instead of using any of the other products, I followed the directions specifically how to use the RV Digest It. Um, it's about $20, $19.95 off Amazon. It's pretty inexpensive. This is a 32 ounce bottle and you use two ounces per dump period. So as a for instance, this is the way you start it. If it's the very first time that you've used RV Digest It, you start off with four ounces in your black tank. You never put any more back in until it's time to dump. When you dump your tank, however long it takes you, days, weeks, depending on the size of your tank, when, it's, when you finish dumping it, you've got it cleaned out and you're getting ready to use it again for the next week, you only put two ounces in. Let me show you what two ounces looks like. This is my measuring cup and you'll see I have a small purple line here of what two ounces looks like. It's very little, very little that you put in there. I was quite, actually quite amazed. So when we started the, two, the six weeks trip, it was cool but comfortable. And then before, <laughs> if, if you're viewing this now, you see what's happening in the southeast. It is some kind of hot and um, we have been using two ounces only. Here's what I've been very pleased with. It liquefies everything in the tank. All your solids, all your toilet paper liquefied. The toilet paper even looks like um, if, if it was used maybe 24 hours ago, it looks like little teeny white specks. It's gone. Um, it is the consistency roughly of coffee uh, coffee with cream. How about that? I'm not going to go into any further discussion about what my black tank output looks like, but that's about what the consistency is. I'm pretty impressed. So when you look at this about how long does a bottle last, 32 ounces, and if you're using this after the initial treatment, 2 ounces into 32, what's that, 16 treatments? So that's 16 weeks that you get out of this bottle for about 20 bucks, a little less than 20 bucks with Prime. Uh, off of Amazon. So I'm pretty impressed with it. So I have a test that I'm going to show you. This is an enzyme. It's reported to be black tank safe. It's not supposed to harm your black tank. And I just want to show you how well this stuff works. I've got a little container here, a little small plastic container, and I have hard dog food. 
you know, just regular dog food like you would give your pup puppy. And it's so hard, I can't even break it. It's, it's really hard dog food. I'm going to put a little bit of water in here and just a cap full or so of RV Digest it. And you're going to be shocked at how quick this stuff breaks down solids in just a couple hours. So here is the um, dog food that I was sharing with you earlier. What I'm going to do is I'm going to pull, pour just a small amount of this RV Digest it into the container here, just an ever so small amount. And then I'm going to add just a little bit of water. I'm trying to do this where I don't make a big mess. And then I'm going to take just a soft drink straw. That's all I'm going to do. I'm not going to agitate this, shake it up hard or anything. And we're going to let this stuff work and see what it does. I'm going to put a stopwatch here. And I'm going to start it. And we're just going to let this run for a little while. And we're going to see how long it's going to take for... Um, this stuff to break down. I think you're going to be pretty impressed with the results. So it's been about 30 minutes. I'm not going to disturb this too much, but you can start seeing these are starting to change color. We'll, uh, we'll see how this continues to go. Um, my understanding, a couple hours this stuff pretty much dissolves and I tried this just in plain water. Uh, not in this test, and um, after eight hours, I gave up and threw the dog food away <laughs> and never broke down. So, um, 39 minutes, we'll come back in about a half hour, see how we're going to continue to progress on this little scientific test of enzyme and dog food. I think this is interesting. This is starting to look interesting now. Again, I'm going to be very careful. I can, you can see this has been what, uh, roughly an hour and 40 minutes. And this dog food is really starting to change in characteristics substantially. Um, we'll see. We're going to let this go for about another hour or so and actually see what happens to it. I'm not going to disturb it too much. But um, I think this is stuff that is going to absolutely come apart here shortly. So uh, we'll give it a few more minutes and see how it goes. So it's slightly over two hours. Uh, two hours and 19 minutes since we started. Now just think about this. This dog food was hard, so hard that I could not even break it apart with my fingers. And I don't want to make a mess here, but it has completely come apart. Uh, the water is changing colors and it is it is absolutely dissolving. You can, let me see if I can just get, maybe get a little, little piece and you can see it's just absolutely turning into just a mush. Um, we'll give it Let's give it another hour, and uh, we'll see where this we'll see where this goes, and then uh, we'll shut it down. Well, we're a little over three and a half hours into the test, and I want you to look at this stuff. I'm going to stop stop the test right now. It is completely completely disintegrating. You can look. As a matter of fact, I'm going to put a lid on this and just kind of turn this sideways so I don't get it everywhere. But you can see the product has just completely turned into granules um, after three and a half hours. And this stuff was hard as a rock. Uh, really, really quite unusual uh, to be able to see this without disturbing it, without shaking it, any of those types of things. Um, three, 340. So I'm pretty impressed with this and uh, I can see why it works so well in the black tank. Well, I hope you found that interesting. I know I did. Uh, and now I have a better understanding why, as I'm monitoring the outflow from my black tank through the clear elbow we have as it goes out to the uh, dump station, why all the solids, all the toilet paper, everything that's in there is just completely, as the name implies, digested. I mean, it is just absolutely liquefied. And now, again, I know that was a bit of a, a concentration that I used in that cup, but again, you know, looking at this stuff, it is just completely, ugh, uh, it's just com completely liquefied, and I imagine if this went another three or four hours, um, there would be nothing left, so, so I'm, I'm a, bit, a bit impressed with the performance. Again, we've been using the product for about uh, six weeks now. Uh, we had a whole bottle, and um, 
and uh, used it once a week. The, the price is, is really pretty good for this stuff. Again, I didn't pay for it. Uh, I was giving a, a bottle to evaluate, but I will be buying some more after this. Uh, I'm providing a link in Amazon where you can buy it on Amazon. It's $19.95 on Prime, uh, or at least it was when this video was created. And then, so you're, if you're looking at 16 tank treatments, that's roughly about a dollar and a quarter uh, a dump, however long, however long you can go in between dumps. And, and that's, that's really, really inexpensive, no perfumey smells, and it really does a good job. One other thing I want to share with you, and I've received several this week, and I'm sorry these folks have had this happen. They've either left the dump gate open on their blank black tank and got a poo dam. Those are awful. I've had one in five years and never want to have another. Um, and I've had another one that said, oh my goodness, we forgot to dump our tank at the end of the fall season, and that black tank sat all winter long and has dried out. Ugh, what a mess. And there's something that you can do with these enzymes um, that really blows that stuff away and breaks it up. So uh, RV Digested has a formula for that. Um, you can take a bottle of this, pour it in your tank, a couple gallons of hot water, let it sit for a day or two, and bluey, it blows it away. Put some more water in there and dump your tank. Uh, I've done that with other enzyme products as well and always had good, good success. And that tank is pretty clean when you get through. Um, so, so that's another option. Uh, the second thing is I do have a PDF that I requested from the company. So if you, so there's some of us, uh, I'm not one of those, who boondock a lot and have very, very large black tanks. Um, and the formula may not be two ounces, maybe just a little bit more. And I asked them to provide me with a PDF on that. And you can go to the show notes that you will see at the end of this video or go out to ilovervlife.com and check my blogs and you can click on those show notes and you'll be able to download that entire PDF if you want to see some other information about this product. So, well, I appreciate the folks at Unique allowing me to evaluate that and sending us a, a bottle to be able to try. Uh, we've had, I think, very, very good results with it in the last six weeks and I think the performance of this little test actually shows how well this stuff really, really works especially with this hard dog food product. I found that quite interesting. These evaluations are fun. I enjoy doing them. And uh, it's just another reason, you got it, it's just another reason I love RV life. Mm -hmm.